Yeah, Ray and Micah, we are told those officers assigned to the mayor's security detail shot at armed robbers who had just robbed a grandfather at gunpoint, and those robbers got away. They say they want money, they want money. Luis Antonio Zayas says he was listening to the radio in his car around 7 o'clock Tuesday morning, waiting to take his grandson to school like he does every day, when robbers opened his door and held a gun to his head. I said, please, please, police, please hear me, please, please, please hear me. He spoke to us by phone, still sore from the encounter. In a struggle, he says the robbers tore his pants as they grabbed his wallet, along with the $220 inside. But people nearby heard his pleas for help. Police sources say officers assigned to Mayor Lori Lightfoot's security detail witnessed the robbery and exchanged gunfire with at least one of the robbers. Chicago police say the officers are assigned to the detached services unit. A neighbor's doorbell camera captured their conversation after the shooting as officers searched the crime scene outside an unmarked building in the 1800 block of North Monticello. It's just a place where they stage and drop off their personal cars. While police say no people were hit, Jake Smith's car is among those now marked with a bullet hole. Yeah, that was a little scary start to the day. Police say one officer did have minor injuries, but they didn't expound on what those injuries are. The Civilian Office of Police Accountability is now in charge of this investigation, and the officers involved will be placed on routine administrative duty for the next 30 days. We're live on the west side tonight. Jenna Barnes, WGN News.